position raise. Ace King suited and wakes up with the queens of the very next hand. Nice. Timex with jacks. We are going to have a collision here. And you missed the aces, buddy. There's and aces. aces. In the There's going to be blood and guts oh. and glory and chips flying everywhere. There's the queens. Does Timex get away from the jacks after it goes under the gun raise? Vindog, surely. Depends how sneaky Vindog's feeling, but I assume he will do better. Now, Vindog is the guy in his avatar. I do see him as the kind of guy that would flat this. <laughs> do you think that's actually him? Like, it's either him or, or an ironic avatar, and I'm not sure which. There's the three bet. Okay, this will be interesting when it gets to Mike. But he's quite good, Timex, isn't he? I hear he wins things. He is. He's, he's quite good at the focus. He's very, very. Have you noticed, by the way, that his eye is like a different kind of eye? Oh, See, true. it's got a little carrot over it. Only Mike McDonald can get away with that. I didn't realize that. So that's like, it must be really difficult. Is he foreign? Is that what uh, it is? Yeah, is it Timex? Timex? Timex. Timex. Can Timex get away from Jax here? The third best hand. What's this? The fourth best starting hand, right? And it's the third best hand here. Yeah. That that's is, quite unlucky. That's very that unlucky. That's quite unfortunate for time. That is complete. Yeah. Nope, he does not. There's the four bet with Jax. So what do you do? There's with no Queen shock. Set? Yeah, does no shock feel like? I mean, Timex is Timex four like cold four betting with air here. I don't think he is that much. I mean, Ever? it's under gun under the gun race, yeah. right? A three bet also in early position. Just a call um, from the Queens. Vin Dog's got to just, loving just, this. just jam He now, is right? loving like, this. This is amazing. He's stroking that moustache with glee. There's so much money in the middle you can win without even, even if you're both your opponents <coughs> full. This is just amazing. I agree with them. Um, <clears throat> PC. I think he will, he will, maybe not snap forward, but I think Timex will get away from this. Now he folds, yeah. And no shock is hating it. Absolutely hating it. Because I assume he was relatively suspicious of the four bet. Now the five bets come in, and he's got queens. Yeah, you're just like... <coughs> is Vindog ever doing with this with Jax? I don't think so. So he's really hoping he... If you, he does the best case is like ace-king yeah. suited, yeah. And that's a flip. But when Timex gets, like, flatted and then, like, a jam, there's so many more hands that are beating Timex. I agree you, with that. Do you convince yourself that both your opponents have ace-king and you're in really good shape with Jax? Sometimes I just think that, you know, like, they're just picking on me. Just, like, right. weirdly level it in they're my head. They're picking on me. Yeah, they're, just... be, they're picking on Timex. <laughs> so Timex does fold. No shock. This would be has, this is key. I mean, can fold. Has invested a big chunk of his stack, but, like, it's not like... He's still going to have 20 big blinds if he folds, or thereabouts. Well, he wasn't calling the full bet to trap, right? He was calling it because he was concerned that he might already be beat. So yeah, how often do you bet. call because you're concerned and then just convince yourself to call again anyway? I mean, I hope because this, well, I don't hope, but I think because this guy has made the, the final table that he's able to kind of take the emotion out of it. Yeah. There's the fold. All right. That's a great, that's a great hand. So that was that a, a fantastic hand. hand. Well done. Now, I... I